What's up, guys? Just got home from work and school here with my main man. What are you doing back there? Say hi. Boom shakalaka. Boom shakalaka. So we just got home. Amazon truck was here and uh, knew what that was. It was uh, the adapter that I ordered um, yesterday, actually, for my uh, to connect to the uh, Beamer Code app. Sorry. Um, I ordered the VPeak OBD Check BLE Plus. Um, basically pluses for Bluetooth. Uh, primarily got it to enable the Sport Plus mode and uh, basically that uh, gives it more of an aggressive drive. Adjust the throttle response, the um, ABS and uh, stability control. So without further ado, let's hook it up. Just a couple notes, the uh, adapter, the Beamer Code no longer accepts the uh, V-Gate adapters. So if you want one, one of the ones that I have, the uh, V-Peak, uh, I'll put the link description below. So <clears throat> the bad news is Beamer Code told me, told me that the Sport Plus is not available for my vehicle. But the other option is to do the um, Sport Automatic Transmission, which um, they said it's basically the same thing, except it doesn't auto Sport Plus enables the uh, traction control as well. Uh, so to do that, we go to Transmission Control Unit and Beamer co Code. And then right there, Sport Automatic Transmission and activate it. Once you activate it, go back and hit Code to do the changes. You don't want to do all your codes first, so just finish one at a time, then go back. The next thing I'm going to do is the Launch Control which is under, I believe it's, it's under the same one, transmission control unit. You want to go to expert mode, application, and right there at the bottom, launch control. And I already have it activated, so, and activate that as well. Another good feature I'll just throw in here real quick is the, the sport displays, if you don't have them. If you go into head unit, scroll down until you see sport displays, Hit activate, go back, and you can change your colors too if you want. They got red or orange. I have mine set to red. Go back and code. Once you're done that, um, you'd be good to go on those three. So we did the uh, sport automatic transmission, the launch control, and the sport displays. Uh, one thing I want to note is when you do put it, the auto automatic, the sport automatic control, when you do hit it over to the um, the automatic transmission. Well, let me turn this on. When you click it over here to, when you hit it over to here, um, you'll see up on my dash, if we can get that. Can you see the S1? So when you see the S1 there, you do not, let me turn this off, put it back in park. You do not want to shift like you would, like a, your paddle shifters, you don't want to, <clears throat> shift up shift down because it'll take it and put it into manual transmission um it'll kick it out of the automatic shifting mode so if you feel comfortable with using that um manually go ahead and do so but just give you that warning that once you do shift up or down it's going to kick it out of that sport uh, automatic transmission so that's uh that's about it if you'd like to see more of this content like share post a comment and subscribe